The SLS rocket for the Artemis II mission has reached a significant milestone, as the assembly of its 65 meters long and 8.5 meter diameter core stage has been completed. Regular viewers of our show may recall that we briefly mentioned this event a few weeks ago. Today, we return to this topic for a simple reason. NASA has released an exceptionally well-made video that captures the entire process. The core stages of the SLS rocket are being constructed at the Michoud Assembly Facility near New Orleans. This large stage is made up of five main components from top to bottom. These are the forward skirt, oxygen tank, intertank, hydrogen tank, and engine section. It was this last mentioned component that was attached to the rest of the stage last. Although the engine section is not remarkable for its size, it is unrivaled in terms of complexity on the core stage. A large number of cables and piping bringing liquefied oxygen and hydrogen to the engines meet here in a small space. It was the development of the engine section that really gave the engineers a hard time. Only four RS-25 rocket engines now remain to be attached to the engine section before testing can begin. This particular specimen could go on the Artemis II mission in late 2024. This will be a special event, as this mission will return humans to the moon after more than half a century. The Artemis II will be a manned test mission to verify the reliability of all systems before exploration missions begin. Thank you for watching the next episode of our show. If you use Twitter, you may be interested to know that we have a profile on that social network. You can find the link in the video description.